Hi guys, John here from Putty RC once again with some more Dal props. So Vale's on. Um we're pleased with my review on the 5045 bull nose. So what we'll do, they've sent me some props for testing and we'll check out the check out the 6045 props. Unfortunately I'm not going to be able to get to fly today, but I thought I'd do this first part of the review. Same same setup as before. Let's see how that goes. Try not to get into shot. I'm still using the 5045 ball nose. Well impressed with those. Straight for number bag, pretty much well balanced. I've only, I didn't actually break one, it split, obviously I can't be using it again, but that was a, a, a naughty crash, um, it took out the Turnergy camera, I've got to say that, <clears throat> that is that is impressive. Prop number two. I was I was a little bit worried to be honest doing this bit, thinking, oh, well, the first lot have got to be have got to be great to get people's attention. But it looks like they're keeping they're keeping up with it. <clears throat> I've, 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 I wasn't a big fan of them ones, but they've sent me some, so I'll try and see where we go from there. Put number two. Lucky for me. I've only got one quad that these will go on, but lucky for me, it's the Night Thug ZMR 250 Night Thug, which can take a bit of a whacking. Hopefully, <clears throat> hopefully, I don't have to smash a whole quad to bits just to see how well these props perform. One's a little bit out, but straight from a bag. Unbelievable. And last but not least, get it right, John. So, like I say, this will be first part. Next part, hopefully, the weather's going to be a little bit better tomorrow, either tomorrow or Sunday, and I will do some. Playing with them on the third quad, same sort of thing. Play about, see if I can try and break one. To be honest, <laughs> yeah. Can swing back. Yes, it is. <clears throat> So that one is a little bit out of balance. It's not the end of the world. You definitely balance a prop up at that anyway. It's only a little bit out. So let's hope they're as good as the 5045s for thrust, speed, agility and crashing. Stay tuned for part two and up in fact 
I won't, I won't, I will do a little review on these as well. I can't get everything spot on. But as for the 5045s, oh, I'm well chuffed with them. Well chuffed. There you go. Thank you, Sibyl's on. Thank you for watching, thumbs up if you like, thumbs down if you don't, all comments are welcome.